Hidden beneath the labyrinth of pipes and ducts, lay an old boiler room. Once a cozy apartment for a family who had long moved away, it had been abandoned and forgotten by its owners. The only resident of this now desolate place was a timid and unassuming cat named Betelgala. Betelgala, a small tabby with soulful eyes and a gentle disposition, had learned to keep to the shadows. He had become a ghost in his own home, his presence barely noticed by the few people who ventured into the boiler room. Yet, every time someone did spot him, their irritation seemed to grow like an unwanted weed, and Betelgala was promptly chased away from his refuge. The days passed in a blur of loneliness for Betelgala. He would find solace in the corners of the boiler room, where the warmth of the old machinery provided some comfort. But despite his best efforts to stay out of sight, it seemed as though the world conspired against him. One fateful evening, Betelgala's luck took a turn for the worse. He had been out exploring the labyrinth of pipes when he encountered a gang of tough alley cats. Perhaps it was his quiet demeanor or his status as an outcast that attracted their unwanted attention, but they pounced on him with fury. The ensuing fight was brutal, and Betelgala was left battered. It was on that very night that he was discovered by a girl named Brittany. As she explored the dark corners of the boiler room with a flashlight in hand, she stumbled upon the injured Betelgala. Her heart ached at the sight of the battered feline, and without hesitation, she knelt beside him. Gently, she extended a trembling hand and offered him some of the food she had brought. Betelgala, though wary at first, sensed something different in this human. He cautiously approached her outstretched hand and, to her amazement, nuzzled it gently. Brittany nursed Betelgala back to health. She cleaned his wounds, fed him, and even gave him a name, calling him Buddy, for short. As weeks turned into months, Betelgala, now Buddy, became a beloved resident of the boiler room. No longer persecuted or chased away, he basked in the love and care that surrounded him thanks to Brittany's unwavering devotion.